You hear that? Uh, yeah, that's the sound of me not giving a damn. Ah. Looks like it's time. Yes. Huh. Keep your phone handy, man, because tonight's gonna get real busy. Come on. I'll take that. Hello everyone, LMPF1 Racer here, back for another video, and as you can quite clearly see, it's time, it's back, it's Need for Speed. It is the first console game released for Need for Speed in two years, it hasn't been re hasn't been one release since Rivals, and even that was just moving on to next gen from 360. I'm pretty sure everyone else is looking forward to this, I'm looking forward to this, so let's get the show on the road. Insert generic FIFA pack opening joke right here. Play. Well, see you soon, bro. If there's only one thing that I think has dis I've disliked about this game so far, it's been the drifting. It's not bad, it's not terrible, but the way it is, I don't like it sometimes. The way that the way I've had it is sometimes the car will just be going around the corner normally, and then out of nowhere the back end will snap out. And it just won't feel right, and I just can't... I can't find the balance between the drift and everything. <laughs> it, it's not very enjoyable, to be honest. He hates on the drift for one reason only. He sucks at it. <laughs> oh. You need a certain finesse to hold that slide or hoon with precision. It's all about riding the tipping point. Am I right or am I right? You're never wrong. I'm afraid this time, Manu, you are wrong. I want the game's new. Give me a break, man. Oh, seriously, the game. I find a way to make the game taunt me in just one way or another. I managed to get this game to taunt me, and I haven't even had it for a week. It's, seriously, what? What do you want me to do? What car do? <laughs> That's a Nissan GTR with a skyline on top of it. I realise the irony. Thanks for watching.